This is one of the rooms that you've done that I really love. First of all, I just really like this soft pink and cream with a hint of gold. And then I see here that you've painted all of these uh, walls in a, in a floral pattern. And it looks like it's coming voilà. from here. So this is quite incredible. Sous les volubilis. You've taken these flowers and, and plants and you've spread them all around. So you, you designed it and had an artist. Exactly. Et le, ici on trouve le, le bambou, le, le, ah, le yes. vrai bambou qui, qui a été repris. So ici. you've even picked up this tiny bamboo detail all around here. It's very lovely. Et les, les, les épis de blé qui passent sous le bambou attachés. C'est ravissant en fait. Comme mm, euh, je, je yes. crois qu'on les, les voit sur le... Yes, it's beautifully done. It's beautifully done. And so the whole wall. And I can see here, it looks like you, you're planning to put a baldacrin exactly. over the bath. And here we have some lovely lead light in the neo Neo-Gothic Neo style. Un petit peu ce qu'on a, c'est l'influence des, des vitraux suisses. On appelle les vitrailles suisses. I was going to say it has that Swiss. That looks yeah. like a Swiss guard. Yeah, exactly. Là, il y a une collection de plats à barbe. Ah, les chanteurs okay. ici est pour mettre le cou et c'était pour les barbes. So this is uh, to wash oui. the beard that goes oui. at the neck, and the beard can be swirled in that. That's gorgeous. So you've really kept it all in the theme and even the color schemes of the framing, on on the color le... scheme there, just to match. But it's a wonderful and creative way and you, you realize how much a paint palette and a brush can do in decoration. And in some ways that you don't need to spend a lot of money. You can create something like this taking the inspiration from a vase, from, from really any reproduction, and then create something very special and very unique. 